Hi there, Scorpios. Thanks so much for tuning in for the week February 10 through 16. And what a wild week we have in store. Everybody gets a little taste of something. Of course, it's Valentine's Day this week, if you didn't know, on Friday the 14th. And along with Valentine's Day, there's a full moon in Leo, which for you represents the ending of something to do with work, the ending of maybe a big project you've been working on, maybe a co-worker that you, you've always enjoyed working with is leaving, something along those lines. So something is about to change for you. I mean, you know how you just love change, Scorpios. However, you must take it in stride and you must soldier on because the world cannot keep, you know, keep at the same rate. People do move on and switch jobs and sometimes they do it really quickly and you find that confusing. Most Scorpios I know have lived in the same home and worked around the, at the same job for at least 10 years. I, can, I know a girl who's lived in the same apartment in New York City for 25 years, brain controlled. But, you know, you couldn't pry her out of there with a can opener. Scorpios really like things, you know, routine, regular. They like to know where they're laying their hat. You're not flitty and flighty. So this is going to be a week with Mercury retrograding further back into the Zodiac, into Aquarius your fourth house of home and family, when you could feel disruption at home. There could be an announcement of a divorce or a separation within the family. Your flatmate decides that you know he or she is leaving and gives you little to no notice. Something like that which will upset you. Take it in stride, Scorpios. Try, try and see the big picture. Change is good and nothing changes unless something changes. And we've got Venus, the goddess of love, in Capricorn, which is a really good place for her, for you. And if you have a partner, try and embrace the commercial, commercial side of Valentine's Day. Don't be too cynical. Enjoy your glass of wine or two, the flowers, the chocolates, and enter into the spirit of it. It's just the one day. And it's going to be quite interesting, too, with that full moon. Have a great week, Scorpio. It's great speaking to you. And I do look forward to speaking to you again next week.